Alright, Mario and everybody else is inside the Great Boggly Tree! The Great Boggly Tree. It's sort of a silly name. It, it almost makes me think that I'm playing the uh, Mick Kids game for the NES. But I'm not. I'm playing Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. And you know, this game also reminds me of Pikmin. Because we're basically playing Pikmin at this point. Mario is basically hurting all these tiny little creatures and getting them to do things for him. And as I understand it, that's what you do in Pikmin. I really only played Pikmin for, I don't know, how long? Five minutes? Ten minutes at the most? I didn't really like that game. They're making a new one, and everybody's excited about it, but... No, I didn't really like the first one. Didn't play the second one. Probably not gonna pick up the third one. Ouch! 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 And you know, um, speaking of that sort of thing, with the Paper Mario series, you know, I played the second one, I really loved it. I played the third one, didn't really like it. Um, played the first one, it's okay. Not sure if I'm going to pick up the fourth one, which is also coming out. Um, it's Paper Mario, like, Sticker Superstar, and in that game, Mario plays with shiny stickers or something like that. I don't know, it, it looked kind of ridiculous, to be quite honest. I'm sure it's going to be fun, but, I mean, stickers? Stickers? Really? Okay, stickers. And let me see, this is a challenge. We need to get to the right-hand side of the room. Cool. We got a Shine Sprite. And an item. But you'll notice we have this huge pit, and the punies cannot pass the pit. You know, the punies can't jump because they have puny little legs, so we're gonna have to use those bubbles. Blow them away with Madame Fury. I mean, Madame Flurry. Not Madame Fury. Um, she doesn't get that angry. That would be a cool boss name, though. You know, like, Madame Fury. Don't mess with her, or she'll use her rage move and destroy you. So, yeah. Super Mario, uh, Sticker Star. Stickers. Yeah. I hope they have shiny stickers, you know, the glittery shiny stickers, those those are always the best stickers, obviously. But I think it's going to be something more like the stickers are, um, items you can use in badges. What, I mean, items you can use in battle. I think, like, the stickers are basically going to replace badges. I think, I think that's what's going to happen. That's what I've seen so far, and we haven't really seen all that much. We've seen, like, what, two minutes of the game at most? And they were all just clips. It wasn't, like, two full minutes of gameplay. Just clips taken from random parts of the game. And let's try out this technique. The Gale Force. I think I figured out how to use this one. Okay, press and hold A, then let go. 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 Press and hold A, and then let go. That's sort of a tricky technique. Ouch, poor Mario. Okay, so that's that technique. Um, blows away some enemies. Clearly does not blow away all the enemies. Yeah, I think either way I'm just not going to use Madame Flurry. Um, even if that technique was super effective, which it's not, I probably wouldn't use her. I don't really like her. No offense to all fans of Madame Fleury. Okay, paper airplane over here. Paper airplane over here in order to get a Shine Sprite. Might as well bring in Koops here so we can win this battle. Okay, Piter Guy. Good, good, good. Okay, I was gonna tell the Piter Guy to get close to the ground so Poops could hurt him. And he did without me even asking him. Thank you very much, Mr. Piter! 
Good luck in the afterlife. So, let's get those little punies. Punies! There you go. Uh-oh, I'm missing four. I bet they are just down on the ground. They were probably scared by the piter and then went running. Here they are. Okay. Here we go. Uh-oh. More enemies. Try to avoid them as I keep going down. That's basically your goal. Just keep going down and down and down and down and down. And eventually you find the crystal star. Mario, did you see it? That was a jabby. Based on what Juniper said, they're helping the intruders and trying to seize the tree. Our tribes have been enemies for a long time now. Every time we meet, we fight. A lot. So I used to get along with Jabble. Random line of dialogue, because, um... We're never gonna meet Jabble. Um, why would they bother to introduce this character? We're never gonna hear about Jabble ever again. Okay, let's fight these Jabbies! So Mario can help out in the battle by um, trying to attack the Jabbies with his hammer. I'm not sure how effective that is because um, I keep feeling that I'm hitting the punies instead of the Jabbies in the battle. I mean, they were so close together as you saw. How do you distinguish between them while you're just smacking around randomly with the hammer? Alrighty. So we have this room where we find... What do we find? The blue key! We just found the blue key! Alright! So using the blue key, we can free all the other punies. Excellent! And we are going to need to free the other punies before continuing, so that's basically what I'm going to do here. And they'll never come back, and that's that, and what's going to happen to us, and... Hey, by the way, what's that thing you've been holding onto so tightly? It's a mushroom. Oh, not to be, you know, rude, but it looks all dry and wrinkly and gross. Yeah, yeah, I know. I think it's so I could give it to my brother to eat. But then I got captured and stuck in here, and after a few days it dried out. Oh, really? Great story. Anyway, don't worry so much. All my complaining aside, I'm sure Punio will return. <gasps> no, but seriously, we're all gonna die now. Yeah, we're, we're dead. Uh, yeah. Doobie -doo, doobie -doobie -doo. I mean, we could continue to the left, but it's really hard, so... Let's get the other punies. Oh, did I just jump on that enemy? That was a dumb, dumb, dumb move. Jump right into the enemy's mouth, Mario. Oh, let's hit all these enemies at once. I don't like long battles. I sort of need more FP. Do I have the badge which refills FP? I don't think I do. Can't hurt the check, can't hurt the check. Yes, I do. Okay, let's get rid of Quake Hammer and Super Appeal. No, that's not it. That's, that's not... Okay, I guess that will have to do. Um, yeah, okay. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Um. Do, 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 do. So, yeah, I don't really like this chapter of the game that much. Um, there's far too much backtracking. Maybe not far too much backtracking, but all that backtracking I did there. 
is going to be repeated when I return to that area with all the other punies. And you'll notice I don't have any of the punies with me, so... What I'm going to do is use the Elder to get the other punies here. Alrighty. Yeah, a lot of backtracking. Going through empty rooms. Um... Yeah. Part of the reason why I don't really like this, uh, particular dungeon. And I lost the punies again. Oh well, I really hope I don't need the punies with me in order to free the others. Alright! At least one of the punies came back. It's our good buddy, Punio. Big brother! Little Petuni! Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? No, fine, fine. Thank heavens. Here, big brother, I have something for you. It's a nasty old mushroom. Oh, nasty. Oh, so gross. Ah, oh, Punio. Give me a hug, Petuni! How can he hug her? He doesn't even have arms. Alright, 101 Dalmatians, I mean Punies, have joined the party. So now we can defeat the evil Cruella de Vil. The other punies. I guess they're just downstairs. And now we need to backtrack all the way to the area I was in before. Whoa, hold on a second. What's going on? We have like a giant puny parade. Alright, we're going in a circle, everybody! Whee! It's like a Ferris wheel! Okay, I'm just having fun being stupid at this point. Alrighty, so I make my way uh, back to the entrance, and this seems like a good place to end the video.